What's up guys, Zach Scott here playing Animal Crossing New Leaf and today look I got some letters I'm sure they're good. I'm sure lots of people are sending me letters because I sent them letters yesterday uh, Yesterday I forgot to I sold a few things but I forgot to go <laughs> and pick up the money from the money rock I have some wallpapers in my inventory mostly exhibit room stuff that I am gonna sell an alpine rug as well And uh, let's read these letters really quick from Prince uh, so Zach, ta-da! I got you a surprise present. I wish I could be there to see the look on your face. You'll just have to tell me about it later. I hope you like it. This, sincerely, Prince. Present for me, from Prince. Open up. Let's open it up. Let's boom, boom. Trunk measure. What is that? And then, uh, from Rod. Dear Athletic Zach, read your letter over and over, bro. Send more. I'm going to jog to the next town over. Be back in two days. Do you want anything? Send me another letter. Is he going to be gone? Is he like, gone for real for like two days? I doubt he is. To Zach, I could get used to receiving gifts every day. Thanks. I thought I'd take this chance to go all out and get you the perfect gift. So enjoy. Hey, take good care of it. From Apollo. And his present is... Lab wall. Whoa, lab wall sounds awesome. From Cat. Hey there, Zach. Your letter was rad. You put a lot of thought into it, too. Worrying about what you're writing slows you down. You just gotta power through it. How cool was my letter? From Silent Cat. Thank you, guys. I want to see what these new things are. This lab wall sounds awesome. Uh, but I want to, you know, see, you know, how it looks. That's what I want to see. How does it look? In, this, in a place like this, who knows? Uh, let's see. Um, well, first, I got a new... Uh, Trunk measure. Oh, I don't like those at all. Take it away. I'll sell that. And then the lab wall sounds really awesome. Hang on the wall. Weird. Let's just hang that back on the wall. Lab wall seems cool. I think I'll hold on to it. Let me go ahead and put it in my inventory really quick. Let's see what I can get out of here. Um, Sweets Closet Ultra Machine. Eye patch. Mm. Oh, here's another exhibit room floor. There we go. Lab walls going up there. Gonna sell a lot of this exhibit room stuff. Anyway, now now I'm off. I'm gonna go pick up that money that I left behind yesterday. I did not mean to do that. And then also search for the next money rock. America's next top money rock. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. Gonna j just bear with me sometimes, that's all I can say. There's a fossil, apparently. I gotta get my fossils appraised today. Gonna make it some major dojo. Maybe, maybe not. Um, let's see. Oh, I, I should see if uh, Gulliver's washed up to shore again. He may have not, but you gotta check on him just to see. You don't want him to just be asleep on the... Oh, he is, oh my god. <laughs> what luck, this is perfect. Mia. Mia. He's gonna freak when he sees me as a skull. Mia, Mia. Maya, mia, mia. <laughs> no, I don't know what he's saying. Mm, don't do that. My beak isn't a can opener. Come on now. You just heard the town bells too. Mia, Mia. Is that Mia, Mia? Or is he like making like a sound? Like, Mia, Mia. Who knows? Z I can't believe how seriously unconscious I am right now. Well, guess what, Gulliver? You're gonna have to wake up and give me a present or something. Mm, Lizzie. But you are my lobster. Come on, Gulliver. Mm, don't do that. My beak is in a can opener. Oh my god, how can I? Can I hit him on the head? With, okay, he's asleep. Gah! Nope, I'm still sleeping. Nope, he's awake now. Good morning, and how is this fine day treating you? I'm Gulliver, a pure-blooded boy of the sea. No, man. Yes, I'm a man of the sea, not a boy anymore. Would you listen to my manly tale? I fell overboard in a pirate scuffle and was dumped into the ocean. Had to be ten, no, fifty pirates. Next thing I knew, I was on this beach snoffing salt water from my manly beak. Canoe. Believe it? Booey, that was close. You were supposed to laugh. I put together a self-depreciating joke and a pun height of comedy. Please, don't make me explain my jokes. Ah, uh, it seems my ability to make people laugh is lost to the cruel mistress of the sea. Hey, that's not the only thing I've lost. I can't seem to remember a bunch of stuff. It's like amnesia. I think I had that once, maybe. So just where was I headed? Oh man, this is sure, this sure is a fuzzy pickle. I'm in way over my head here, oh I know. It's so obvious. Will you help me figure out where I was heading? Sure, I'll help you out, buddy. 
You mean it? I haven't met such a noble skipper since old Bobbery of Rogueport. Not even close now. Th by the way, this is the same exact script he said last time. He must really have amnesia. Now, I suppose we could start with anything and everything I remember about where I was going. All right. So the country I wanted to visit is uh, very long and sort of shaped like a boot. It's Italy. Whoa, where do my boots go? You know what else is long? Pasta. Their pasta is so good. It'll make you tell off your mama. But hey, be careful because if your mom is anything like mine, she's a nice lady and she deserves respect this place is also famous for a place called the eternal city ah oh, what's the name I can feel like I feel like the answer is on the tip of my beak oh Fortuna I could use you it is Italy I knew it by heart that's it that's it I'm sure I was going to Italy Graze, thank you. I'm both super thankful and thoroughly impressed. Thanks to you, I'll be able to eat plates and plates of delicious Italian pasta, just like that plumber guy, <laughs> Mario. I promise I'll send you a fancy souvenir. It might take a while, but you better get your hopes up. All right, so thank you so much, Gulliver. That is exciting. Italy, I knew it was Italy. I knew it. What's up, Amelia? Hey, Zach, remember that time capsule you buried for me a while ago? Can you dig it up? You do remember where you buried it, right? Right? I think I may remember. Is it on the... Whoa, who's this? Hey, what's up, Apollo? Hey, Shorty, can I get a minute? The truth is, I've been thinking it's about time for me to leave this place behind. Why? I just... was your friend. We're friends. We're best friends. Why would you want to leave? It's, guys, is there any reason that someone would want to leave the town if I kept up this town quite nicely? I've also have been good friends with Apollo, trading with him, doing stuff for him. Is there any reason that he would want to leave? It's not that I started to hate a story or anything, though. It's actually pretty nice here. That's why I'm thinking I gotta bust out of this lukewarm place and harden myself up again. I've already picked a day, too. I'll be leaving on the 24th of this very month. Don't leave. Hey, are you trying to stop me from going or something? I certainly wasn't expecting that, but I suppose I understand your point, Shorty. I guess I'll stay in Astoria for a little while longer and continue bothering people a bit more. Thank you. God. Why would he want to leave? There is the time capsule that I buried for uh, Amelia. It's right here. Boom, got it. And uh, now would be a good time to finish up the little path from like... Hey, what's up, cat? Wouldn't it be funny if a fish cast a line with pizza on it up here onto the shore, Purdy? She is so high on catnip. Oh my god. All right, Amelia, why'd you walk off? Seriously, why? You knew I was gonna do a mission for you. Amelia. Amelia, you come back here this instant. Oh, excuse me. There we go. Seriously, where's Amelia? That's Apollo. Amelia! There you are. You were wanting something, right? Hey, bird brain again. Aren't you busy, Zach? Was there something you wanted, Ace? Got the capsule. And there it is right there from Amelia to you. I can't wait to look inside, Ace. Oh, Zach, isn't this my old picnic shirt? Oh, wait, there's a letter inside too, Ace. I completely forgot I put that in there. To the future me, why did I want this buried? It's seriously clashing with everything in my wardrobe. When it comes back, I bet my look will be different, and there will be harmony from past Amelia. That's what all this was about. I can be so ridiculous once in a while, Ace. Since you helped me with all this, you can have what you buried for me, Zach. Great, the picnic shirt, good, good. I really hope you enjoy it. It's a picnic shirt, and if you ever need help with something, if I ever need help with something crazy like this ever again, I'll know who to ask. Great, please burden me with your requests. Puddles, Ribbit, hello, hello, Splish. Oh, so what's going on, Splish? I wanna chat. You totally know Pearl, right? Well, the last time we were talking, our neighbor left something in my house. Who, who's, what neighbor? Just tell me who it was. Could you return it to her place? I'm just so busy. I'm on it. Oh, 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 Pearl did. <laughs> Our neighbor is in Pearl. Our neighbor, Pearl. Okay, got it. Sorry. I know it's asking a lot, but make sure you get it done today, okay? Yeah, sure. I can do that. Pearl, I'm going to find you. And if not, I'm going to open up your letter. It's that simple. Which will it be, Pearl? Is she at home by any chance? Let's look for smoke. She's home. 
smoking. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. All right. Hey, Pearl. Oh, man, nice house. This looks elegant. Well, if it isn't Zach, per meow. <laughs> so what did you want, Zach? Delivery. Well, what's this? It is a present to Pearl. There you go. What? This is something I lost, kitten. It's my six ball tea. I thought I'd never see this again, kitten. Anyway, thank you, Zach. How about you take this with you for all of your trouble? What is this? That style could really suit you. It's a bubblegum shirt. Thanks. Well, hey, well, what's going on? I haven't chatted with you in a long time. You're my direct neighbor. I haven't even talked to you lately. Talk to me. Kind of a slow week ahead in a story. Why don't you say no fun events on the horizon? Well, I guess it's a chance to catch up with some housekeeping or pull some weeds. Maybe I'll go fishing. We got Halloween coming up. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. I don't know. Do they call it Halloween here? They should. They should maybe call it Monster Day. That'd be kind of weird. Okay. I'm going to sell some stuff. I need to. Because, uh... I mean, no, no real direct reason. I just I have a full inventory. That's it. All right, just looking around. Lots of people have been planting flowers and stuff here. That's pretty cool, I suppose. There's a, probably a fossil, but I probably have no room. And that is the truth. Don't you know it? All right, I can check this one rock that's here. And... She bangs, she bangs, money rock time. Oh yeah. Oh no. Oh no, 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 I'm getting far away. I meant to, oh no, no. <laughs> okay. What can I do about that? Be careful next time, that's all I can do. Can't change the past, but I can look forward to the future. I have stuff to sell to you, Reese. I also have some, uh, some fossils I need to appraise, but I'll have to do that in a little bit. For now, you got an exhibit room wall, an, an alpine rug, an exhibit room floor, a trunk measure, an exhibit room floor, an exhibit room wall, and two shirts. That seems good. I don't give two shirts. <laughs> Actually, that's not true, because I am giving two shirts. Here we go, deal. Not very much, it just clears my inventory. That's all it really does. I could either throw them away or sell them for a little bit of cash. I'd rather Reese uh, profit from this. A benefit in some fashion that makes her happy. Because if it makes you happy... I won't sing it. You know the song. Or do you? Here we go. Uh, hopefully I can pick all this stuff up in my inventory. Money, money, money. Oh yeah, money. Big money. There we go. And then, uh, oh yeah, there was like a fossil over here. I might as well just pick it up since I, I will probably have it appraised. I feel so good that I don't have to uh, buy fortune cookies anymore. That feels amazing, having all of the N Nintendo items. Next on the list, though, I need to arrange my museum. And I don't know how I'm going to do that. I don't know if I need to do that off camera or I sh if I should just do it in front of you guys. Um, any birds? Any tweets? Tweet, tweet, tweets. All right, from 5 p.m., half price at the store. What time is it now? Let's see. 5.10, perfect. Excellent. What fake rock? Knew it. You know how I knew? Because it was there. There's never a rock there. There's Hopper. No one set up shop here, but that's okay. I got uh, some things to get over here. And then I'll make my way up top. Tippity top, yo. Uh, go ahead and just combine this. Drop it in. My god, okay. All of it. Remove all of it. And then start uh, collecting more and more money, that is. Hopefully that one cat moves in soon so I know where to start putting trails and figuring that kind of stuff out. And then hopefully Hopper leaves even sooner than that. And uh, let's be off. Hi. Goodbye. I thought he looked cool at first, but really he just looks so angry and I don't like that. I think that looks very, uh, he looks very angry. I don't like him looking angry. Anything here that's worth it? I don't know, I could get a fruit. Let's go, um. Let's go in order. Able, well, 
Yeah, let's let's go in order. Let's actually go in order. We'll go this way first. Have him appraise my fossils. He's taking a drink of water. Sorry if you can hear the swallowing sound. <laughs> Sometimes that is annoying, but I apologize. Oh dear, pardon me. Welcome to the Astoria Museum. And you're going to assess a fossil. All right. Come on, I got like four. Not too many, but it's a decent score. And I know that you're already gonna have them. I wish I could bypass this dialogue. I can get a lot more gameplay in per day if, if these dialogues could just be completely skipped. But uh, that's okay. I understand how this game works. They want it to work where like, if you pick up someone else's game, you can understand what's happening, I think. I think that's what their goal is. Because he just keeps talking and talking and my thumb is just pressing and pressing and nothing is happening. Except for he's talking and my thumb is pressing. Those are the only two things that are happening because it's not skipping. Okay, let's go over to the Abel sisters and see if there's anything to buy. Any masks. I like masks. Maskuses. There is a mask. Hold on. What is that? Is that a new mask? Wicked cool. The bug mask. Yes, I'll take that. That is awesome. Yes, give me the bug mask. Holy moly, I can be a bug. And can I keep my star? Because that looks like bug eyes. Oh, no, it's a helmet. Whatever, I'm looking cool as can be. So thank you so much. That was great. Maybe I'll be the bug. I'm the bug. Bug mask. Hi. Welcome. I did not really exactly totally mean to come here, but I did because I walked this way. But I'm out of here. I'm a bug with skeleton pants and a hot dog. Shirt. So, where are we going, guys? I say we go over to TNT Emporium. I should really have a shrunk teach me another joke. That would be beneficial. For the truth. Welcome, welcome. We have a time special. Yes, so guess what? That means buy a fertilizer. I'm gonna buy as much from this guy as I can. I'm gonna buy it. Give it. Give it to me. I'm also gonna buy this. That way I don't have to pick one. <laughs> it's 500. Whatever. I'm gonna buy it. I'm in a spending mood since you guys are having a sale. The psychology of this is really working for me. I'm gonna buy some candy. There we go. A candy. I'm going to buy one candy. It's on sale for 200 bells. Thank you. I'll take it. Let's check out the records. This will be a great time to get some cool deals on some nice tunes. KK Dixie. I already have that, though, I believe. It sounds familiar. It sounds like I have it. It sounds like, you know, something that I, I would frequently listen to. Not really. But, hey, uh, where is it? I'm, I'm checking. I have it. Fine item, cheap, but I already have it. I don't need a backup of that. My vinyls are, I keep them in good condition. KK Calypso, do not have this. I just passed it by when I was looking and I saw like, what Calypso? What does that even mean? But guess what? I don't have it, so I'm gonna buy it. And there we go. Thank you kindly for your, oh wait, what's this? It seems you're already carrying a great many things, come on. Okay, well you know what? Will you wanna buy some stuff? I'm in charge of the first floor. If you need to speak with my older brother, Timmy, please visit the second floor. I want to sell. I'm here. Might as well just get it over with. I know that there's a, uh, that there is a, uh, you know, a f not, not really a fee, so to speak. Not the skeleton hood. This is one thing. Sell the ruby. Confirm it. Confirm it, yes. 60, that sounds like a good deal. And then I'll trade that 1600 for this one. That was like an even trade, I'll take it. We should just barter, man. We should bring up like a trade dialogue and make the exchanges. Second floor time, let's see what's on the second floor. And, um, whoa. Hello, welcome, welcome. This is the second floor. <laughs> sure it is, isn't it? Uh, wicked. This place is crazy looking. Do I have the vanity? I think I have the vanity. You know how you can check to see if you have the vanity? By checking the computers. Is this a computer? No, that's just a... Okay, no, that's not a computer. 
There's a computer downstairs, and what is this? This is like a, uh, uh, oh, a modern, never mind, I don't need the modern stuff. No, but I will check the TVs and stuff. Let's see it. Playroom wall, no thanks. No thanks. Is Gracie half off too? Because that would be amazing if she was half off, you know, her stuff. A spooky wall, I already have it. No, 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 I'm done talking. No, thanks. I need to check out to see if I have the spooky vanity. I'm pretty sure I have it. Steel flooring is cool, but no. No thanks. Sorry. I'm just looking around, guys. This is part of my job here. As an animal crossing the opulent rug. Uh, show me the opulent rug. Uh, it looks quite fancy, but no thanks. I don't have any plans to decorate in a fancy fashion, so let's just go ahead and be understood. And then we will uh, go up here, see what Gracie has to offer. And is her stuff half off? I have no idea. It'd be really cool if it was, but again, I have no idea. I have those both. These clothes are neat. Is this the, the cheeseburger tank or something? Let's see. A sweets wall. Let's see, how much is the sweets wall? Is it on sale for half off? Nope. That's quite a price. All right, well, I'm out of here. I'm gonna go downstairs and check out the price, uh, check out to see if I have the vanity. And if I don't, I guess I'll go back upstairs and buy it, but I think I need to go to uh, Shrunk and learn a joke. I think that's what I need to do. Okay, let's check it out. I should have the spooky vanity. It should say that I have it. I believe I have it. I just want to see it for my own eyes. No, not D S. Spooky. Confirm. Let's see what all I have with the title spooky. Uh, I do have the spooky vanity. Great. Let's go back. Let's quit it. Thanks for using the, t yeah, thank you. You're w no, no, don't go upstairs, I thought that was out. But it's obviously not out. Let's see, down, what? Welcome, welcome, this is the second floor. Yes, I've been here, come on, leave me alone. All right. Now let's go out by going this way. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Thanks for visiting, come again. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Alrighty, let's end today's video with a uh, with a little journey, the club LOL, and we will check in with the one and only Shrunk for an amazing new joke. I have a persimmon that I bought for 500 that he's going to love. Maybe he'll tell me the best joke ever, but I did bring you a snack. Hopefully you can eat persimmons. It'd be funny if that, like, that was like his one weakness or something. But here you go, it's a persimmon. It's expensive, you're gonna love it. Ta-da! I've never, I don't think I've ever eaten one. A persimmon, don't mind if I do. There you go. Woo, that was quite satisfying. Well, thanks a bunch. I should probably return the favor now, shouldn't I? Hmm, then how about I tell you a really good joke today? All right, let's skip this and get ready for it. He's gonna wow our feets off. Feet, I don't know. Thank you, thank you, Dr. Shrunk is in the house. My sneezing joke is just the thing to cure what ails you, unless what ails you is the sniffles. My grandma used to tell me that uh, that when you sneeze, it means someone is talking about you. I used to be pretty popular back in the day, so I got used to people talking about me here and there. It hasn't really happened since I retired, though. Achoo! Huh? Could it be that someone out there is talking about me? Achoo! Achoo! See? They must be. Achoo! Achoo! Okay, stop. For real. Achoo! Stop it! Uh oh, maybe it's my human allergies coming back again. <laughs> Alright. That's cool. Learn a new sneeze joke. I'm gonna be a, the bug who sneezes. Here we go. Well, I got a lot done today. I learned a new sneezing joke. I talked to uh, that one dude. Totally forget his name. Uh, <laughs> uh, Gulliver. Where's my... Oh, yeah, my emotions are over here. I wear my emotions on my sleeve. Sneeze. 
There we go. Cool. Anyway, guys, I'll see you next time for more Animal Crossing New Leaf. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thanks so much for watching and check out these other awesome videos. See you next time.